Hey, it's Jamie from Schedulicity. Let's go over importing your client list into your business account. First, navigate to the client's icon on the left-hand side of the screen. From here, you will have the option to add clients individually or from a client list. When you choose Import a Client List, you will see two options. If you choose to import the list yourself, you will want to get your list organized in the proper format so everything ends up in the right area of the profile. You will want to include all five columns even if you don't have that particular info. First name, middle name, last name, email, and phone number. For example, if you don't have the middle name of your clients, be sure to leave that column blank and then we know not to put anything in that field. Now that your list is ready to go, go ahead and click the import button in the upper right hand corner. Make sure the format is a .csv file so it will upload. If you would like us to import the client list for you for free, you can just email it to us at support at and we will happily import your clients for you. This usually takes between two and three days, but we try to be as quick as possible. The file types that work best for us to import are a vCard, CSV, or Excel. If you do have your contacts in a different format, just send it over to us and we'll see what we can do. No matter how you import your clients, it's best to double check everything just to make sure it's all good to go before your import, and it's always good to check for duplicate clients. This is especially important if you already have clients in your Schedule C database. Otherwise, you may end up with a messy client list. So triple check your information and make sure it's exactly how you want it. Thanks for watching and let us know if you have any questions or reach out to us at support at schedulist.com. So when you import the list, everything is in the right place. <laughs> Just get it right, okay? <laughs> so trick, triple, trickle, trickle, trick, trick, trickle. <laughs> and it's always good to check for duplicate clients. Duplicate. <laughs> Duplicate. Duplicate clients. Duplicate clients. Duplicate clients. And also check for duplicate clients. <laughs> clients.